play games. Then playing silly. Yeah. I'm freaking for real. I think silicone butts are ill. Ew. Where'd she got that alpha? Ew. That girl is totally ratchet. Ew. Seriously, who likes that? Ew. Right, right, ew. 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 Look at the way she takes back. So what's up with those duck lips? Ew. She's so lame. Ew. 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 This is embarrassing. Ew. 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 Like, seriously, seriously. Ew. 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 No, seriously, seriously. Ew. 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 Oh my god. Ew. Ew. I am not hating. I am merely conversating with my BFF, Sarah. So bust your rhyme, Sarah. It's near I am and you know who. Now here's some things I think are ill. Face time and reclining in airplane seats and they're finding retweeting tweets on that line because they've been rhyming tonight. I read both of my be only got to roll a little bit. got a pillar. I'm a really old and wealthy witness still. Trapper keepers trying to keep wearing sneakers with the toes. Maybe frozen because you know when I don't want to bust it. So that was Jimmy Fallon featuring Will I Am in the song "Ow," and I know a lot of you guys have heard me say that "ow" thing constantly if you guys are friends with me, and also in a lot of the, and in in the stories I say "ow" a lot because of course they have the word "ew," and I love it because it's "ow," and I mean it's so awesome and I love that song, and it's it's so catchy because once you hear it you want to listen to it over and over and over again. That's what I did when I first heard the song. I'm like, what is this crap? And he's like, oh, this is Jimmy Fallon. It's with Will I Am. He, it's a song called E. Okay. It's cool. Why don't you listen to it more? Because you might like it. Now, one thing I want to get out of the way. Jimmy Fallon can fucking rap. That is him a legit rapping. What the heck? Why did I do that? I just went to the next chapter without even reading the last paragraph. Wow, I'm so stupid. Did I literally just miss one? 40... What the heck? Something went wrong. Oh, no. Nothing. Sorry, my bad. I just accidentally hit the button. Alright, chapter 39. Apparently we found out that, um, what the secret was. And then we found, and then, um, now Justin and, um, Tyler are on a Ferris wheel. Then he said softly, his eyes sparkling brightly as he looked into my eyes. One last kiss. I nod as he leaned closer and kissed me. His his lips warm and my eyes filled with water. A tear, a tear drop rolled down my cheek as the kiss continued on. The last kiss of my beloved Justin. Chapter 40 The summer passed by quickly. Before I knew it, college rolled around. I packed my bags and had the door saying goodbye to my family, Anne and Nick both heading the same direction. Deciding to take take the train with me on our way to our colleges to college. So this is it, Anne smiled, hugging both Nick and I. All these years of always being together, we finally part ways. We said both Nick she kissed both Nick and my cheek. Her soft lips remain reminding me of Justin's. I touched my lips, remembering the night he kissed me goodbye. I've noticed that every night I dream about him. Only then he is with me. The train comes to a stop and calls my station. I stepped off and waved goodbye to Anne and Nick as the train began to move once more. I could see tears welling up in Anne's eyes and Nick good and Nick waved goodbye, holding on to Anne's shoulder. The first thing I the first first thing I hailed a taxi which shook me to my college. Upon arrival I received a warm welcome from the people at the dorm who seemed happy, full of energy and joy. I dropped my bags in my room and walked and wa and walked out without unpacking. I headed downstairs by the door a sigh with with my address showed a welcoming party for a new student tonight at nine. Hoping I meet some new friends. Even though I'm not a party person or a good drinker, I decide to go. Once I entered, it reminded me of the party. Justin or any of the members of the clique who would have held, but not as extravagant. I walked over to the punch bowl table to make sure I took a cup of punch instead of beer. Oh, sorry, a girl bumped to me. It's fine, I mumbled quietly, almost to myself. You alone? I didn't answer her, and he looked... And looked and looked at the ground. You got a girlfriend? She questioned. 
Is she hitting on me? Does she like strange guys like me? Pale, pale, pale skin, dark hair, and socially awkward. Not anymore. I used to be straight, I said, turning to her, until I met him. I smile even now just thinking about how or how about him. Warms my heart. She slightly covers her mouth and giggles quietly. Who's he? She smiled at me. Me. I turned around and angels began to sing. Is this a dream? I draw my punch and rub my eyes. Staying in front of me. Still with his suitcase, Justin smiled at me warmly. I ran up to him and hugged him tightly. Tears coming back. No matter what you say or tell me to leave you alone, I can't. No matter what, he whispers into my ear. I hugged him tighter. With every passing second, how I met, how I missed him. His touch, his smell, his love. You are my dream, and I'm following you wherever I go. Oh my god, that's so romantic. Oh my god, that's so cute. Oh, only if my life could be like that. Alright, since I'm at the end of this book, before I read the sequel, I want to give a shout out to K someone. Thank you for making this book. This book is amazing. I love this book to death. It's so good. And if you guys know this person, or if you guys want to like tell her to tell about the story, um, I love this book. It's so good, and I love what you did with it. It literally when I when I started reading this, like I wanted to cry. Like when I listened to my videos back, when I started to like watch this again, listen to it, I start I like start to cry because of how sweet it is. I want to get emotional. The sequel is here. Tyler and Justin are now in college. New school means new com complications, new people, and new candidates for love rivals. Click below for the sequel, Just a Boy. So we are going to click, I'm going to click that, and we are going to be starring Just a Boy. I, oh my god! So, um, one thing, um, I'm actually going to be doing, um, god, I don't know what I'm going to do. Who is this? I have to see who this is. Okay, so that's Tyler. Okay, we have a small problem. Alright, one thing that's a problem here is because we're starting a new book, and I want to put the cover, but there's a picture. So, um, instead of putting, um, I Kissed a Boy picture here for this video, you guys will be seeing the picture of the next book. Because as you guys know, I said when I first got the picture that I can save it. I'm going to. Oh, whoopsies. Okay. So, yeah. I had to make a new folder. So, yeah. And until next time, gay is okay. Just ask the GSA. Come on.